Leah, are you inside? Come outside here right now. I want to talk to you. Excuse me? Hi, Donnie. What are you doing here? I'm right here right now to give out to you because I just met Sophia. She's balling her eyes out. She's got a black eye. She said that you attacked her. You're crazy. I'm what? calling the police. Are you serious? Hold on. Wait a minute. Don't be calling the police. Do you even know what happened, Donnie? I went up to Sophia to talk to her like a normal person because she grounded baby Kai for no reason. And guess what? She decided hitting me out of nowhere. Well, you know what? She said the opposite. She said that you arrived in and started shouting and screaming about giving out to baby Kai when he's been a bow boy and then you attacked her and started punching her. And you know what? Where's baby Kai right now? I gotta take him home. Okay. Shouldn't be down here. Hold on one second. I will tell you the whole story because obviously you're so blinded by your big love for that babysitter that you're going crazy and you don't even know what really happened. Baby Kai came up to me saying he's really upset because he wanted to come visit me for lunch and Sophia wouldn't let him and then she grounded him and started saying horrible things. And of course, baby Kai told me and I got mad. And all I said is that it's not Sophia's place to be grounding my own children. And how dare you give her that responsibility? I mean, that girl, she's so young. She probably never babysat in her lifetime. And she really did upset baby Kai. So I went up and I talked to her. And the next thing, Donnie, she just went crazy. And I mean like really, really crazy and started hitting me. Myself and baby Kai, we got so scared we had to run away. And guess what? She started chasing us. I mean, why would she chase us if I was the one attacking her, huh? All right, all right, all right. I'm fed up with all your lies, okay? You came into a house there. You don't live anymore. Or you've got no right to be there. And you attack someone that works there. You wrong. are losing your mind again, okay? Wrong, no more wrong, seeing the kids. Wrong. No more hanging out up in the house. If you want to see the kids, you got to ring me and tell me that you're coming up. <laughs> I'll arrange a meeting, okay? And you know what? Where's baby Kai? I've got to get him back. i got to no. get him back up to the house. No, baby Kai is staying is with he? me. It's not safe to be in the house with Sophia. And Donnie, I don't need to ask you. Excuse baby me, Kai. get out. You're not supposed to baby be in my Kai. house. Where is he? Is he you're in the kitchen not... eating food? No, you're not going to find him, Donnie. You well, have to get out. Why did you out. walk into my house if, you can... if I can walk into your house? Donnie, can I just talk for a second without being interrupted? You have no right to take the children away from me. I'm their mother, and if I want to see them, I will see them. You don't have a court order or anything like that. And if you want, we can go. That's fine, Leah. But he lives I am in the not palace, finished. and it's time for him to go home. So he needs no. to be at home right now. No, and you know what? This is not his home. No, baby Kai is staying here, and I'm taking baby Kyla as well, on the grounds that it's not safe in that house with that psycho nanny. That nanny is just for you, and she's not even for the kids, because guess what? She doesn't love our children, she doesn't respect them, she was given out to baby Kai and grounding him for no reason. The poor child is traumatized after she attacked me. So, I'm taking baby Kai, and she will stay with me for a while. You're not taking baby Kai and you're not taking baby Kyle, okay? They live up in the palace. That's where they live. You're the one who left and not them. So you just stay down here in your little house and your little boyfriend and stay away from us. What if baby Kyla chooses to stay with me? Surely you can't force her because you know what? Baby Kai chose to stay with me and he is not coming back to you, Donnie. Get over yourself. He is coming back to me because that's where he lives. If you <laughs> want to take them, then you have to go to court and you have to get permission, okay? You can't just come and just kidnap children like that. I'm going to call the police on you. What? That's not kidnapping. I'm the mother, Donnie. You know what? Go back to the nanny and have loads of lovely kisses and cuddles with her. Because guess what? At this stage, I don't really think you care about the well-being of our children. You only care to destroy my life and to enjoy yours. So go ahead, Donnie. Go enjoy your great life. You're the one going around punching people, all right? You're the one acting crazy. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Baby Kai, what you doing, darling? Hey, Mammy, was that daddy outside? Um, yeah, it was your father, but don't worry, everything is okay. Now, what would you like to do today? Mm, I don't know, I don't know. I'm just a little bit upset because daddy's down there shouting at you and I don't want to go back to his house, okay? I want to stay here. I want to stay here with you. It's way more fun and that Sophia girl is just a big meanie. I know, baby. Don't be scared. You're not going anywhere. You're staying with mommy and that's the end of it. And if your father doesn't like it, that's his own problem. I know you're scared of Sophia. She did go a bit crazy on us, baby Kai. But please, don't be scared. Now you're here and you're with me and you're safe enough. 
But I am worried about your sister. I mean, your father, he won't let her come and live with me, so... I don't really know what to do, baby Kai. I'm really upset because I feel like baby Kyla, she's in danger staying in that house with that crazy psycho nanny. Mammy, we gotta go get baby Kyla. We can't just leave her up there like that. Let you see all scared and she's all worried where I am and she hasn't seen you in ages. You know what we gotta do? We gotta go, baby, get baby Kyla and bring her back here so daddy doesn't even know that she's gone. Um, you mean we'll just take baby Kyla behind your daddy's back? Oh, I don't yeah, know. he's too busy talking to that Sophia girl anyway, being all kissy kissy and everything. So let's just go take baby Kyla down here and daddy won't be able to come down and get us because he's just a big meanie as well. Okay, maybe that's a good idea. I mean, she is my daughter, so it's not like I'll get into some kind of trouble with the police. And she is not, not you know safe there, so maybe we should wait till it goes really, really dark. And we'll go through the balcony and explain the whole situation to baby Kyla. Now, we're not going to force her to come with us. We're just going to tell her what happened with Sophia and give her a choice. And if she, she, if she decides to stay there, that's fine. But if she decides to come with us, then we take her with us. And if your dad has any problems with that, then you know what? He can go to the police and sort it out. Absolutely, that's an awesome idea. We're gonna be like a couple of little ninjas going up in there and there, sneaking up the balcony, jump inside and we'll grab baby Kyla. And you know what? This is gonna be so super cool and daddy won't have a clue what's going on. Oh, I really hope so. I really don't want to get caught because I don't want to get into a fight with your father and Sophia in front of you kids. I just need to protect you from all of this. When me and your father, when we decided to separate, I didn't think that this would happen, baby Kai, but I feel like that Sophia girl, she's just making your father go crazy. He's trying to steal you guys away from me, and I can't let that happen. You're still my babies, and you always will be, no matter how old you are. Yeah, I'm still gonna be your mother, and I'll always be there to take care of you, and I don't care about that nanny. That nanny has to go. We just have to hope that your father would realize how evil she is. Are you ready, baby Kai? Yeah, man, this is awesome. Okay, don't go through there. You might get caught. Come around the back way. Here, look. Okay, just be really, so really sweet. quiet. Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. I'm so nervous about this. Follow me, follow me. Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. Okay, this face. way. Awesome, awesome. You okay? okay? Look, that's her. Her bedroom's right there, but we can't get up that balcony. Maybe we can go in my balcony and then sneak around. Yeah, exactly. That's a good idea, but just be careful. I don't want your father to see us. Oh, goodness. This is so scary. Okay. Nobody's oh, in your bedroom. Up, up. Okay, I'm, I'm coming. I'm coming. Shh. Baby Kyla. Shh. That was so loud. Okay, go, go, oh, go, gosh. Go. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Baby Kyla. Baby Kyla. Baby just, Kyla. Just... Oh, darling. How I've missed you. Oh, look at you. All on her own. Just playing with your toys. Are you okay, baby girl? Um, we're here to take you with us if you want to come with us. Mommy, mommy, and baby Kai. Oh, guys, I've missed you so much. What happened? What's going on? Daddy said that you guys attacked Sophia and she was crying all day. I really don't know what's happening anymore. Baby Kyla, it's all lies, okay? Sophia is crazy. She tried to ground me because I wanted to go see Mammy. She made the, tried to force me to eat some food I didn't even want. She was so mean to me. And then I told Mammy, and Mammy came in and gave out to her. And then she attacked Mammy instead of punching Mammy and punching me in the face. We had to run away and she chased us down out, out of the garden. She's totally gone crazy. Oh my gosh, she did the exact same thing to me. She started forcing me to eat that stinky grilled chicken salad. It was so disgusting, but I had to eat it because she said that she'll drown me forever. Oh, guys, I'm so sorry of what happened, but why are you with mommy and why am I stuck here? And daddy said that I have to stay in my room all day every day and stay away from mommy, but I really want to go to mommy. I hate being here. I don't want to stay in this house with Sophia. Yeah, yeah, it's totally cool. You know what? We're here to save you because I've been staying with Mammy and Daddy came down and she wouldn't let him see me. So we're going to go and we're going to live with Mammy and we're going to leave this place. So grab your dollies, grab some clothes and let's jump out the balcony and go down to Mammy's house on the beach. Oh my gosh, this is so much fun. Okay, okay, guys, this is just the best idea ever. But I do feel sorry for Daddy. Like, should we leave him some kind of a note or tell him where I'm gone? I still love Daddy. It's just Sophia that I don't like. She's a really evil babysitter, isn't she? 
She is so horrible. But you know what? We're just going to text Daddy when we get down there and say we're living down there now with Mommy and that's it, okay? So don't worry about him. Just grab your stuff and let's go. That's right, baby Kyla. Don't worry about the note. We don't have much time. They could be up here any minute now to say goodnight to you or whatever. So we got to go right now, baby girl. And don't worry, I'm gonna call your father tomorrow and explain it to him. I'll explain to him the whole situation and that you guys are not coming back here until that evil nanny is gone. Alright, come on guys. Grab these toys and let's go quickly. Hurry, hurry, hurry. We don't have much time. This way, baby Kyla, this way. 